Hi, Stone Prince Technique, this is Andrews. And today I want to give a special thank you, special shout out to Abraham Laborel. I remember as a young man, I saw Abraham Laborel one day. That was in 1996. He was playing the bass for Don Muen and the Integrity Music team. I was so impressed by the way this man was jumping on stage, by his energy and by the grace of God upon his life. That was the day I caught that fire to learn the bass guitar. He really moved me to learn this beautiful instrument. And I want to dedicate Psalm 119 to him. Thank you so much, Abraham Laborel. Psalm 119. Blessed are those whose ways are blameless. Who walk according to the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his statutes. And seek him with all their heart. They do no wrong. But follow his ways. You have laid down precepts that are to be fully obeyed. Oh, that my ways were steadfast in obeying your decrees. Then I would not be put to shame. When I consider all your commands, I will praise you with an upright heart as I learn your righteous laws. I will obey your decrees. Do not utterly forsake me. How can a young man stay in the path of purity? By living according to your word. I seek you with all my heart. Do not let me stray from your commands. I have hidden your word in my heart. That I might not sin against you. Praise be to you, Lord. Teach me your decrees. With my lips I recount all the laws that come from your mouth. I rejoice in following your statutes as one rejoices in great riches. I meditate on your precepts and consider your ways. I delight in your decrees. I will not neglect your word. Be good to your servant while I live, that I may obey your word. Open my eyes that I may see wonderful things in your law. I am a stranger on earth. Do not hide your command from me. My soul is consumed with longings. For your laws at all times. You rebuke the arrogant. Who are accused. Those who stray from your commands. Remove from me their scorn and contempt. For I keep your statutes. Don't rulers sit together and slander me. Your servant will meditate on your decrees. Your statutes are my delight. 
are my counselors. I am laid low in the dust. Preserve my life according to your word. I give an account of my ways. And you answered me. Teach me your decrees. Cause me to understand the way of your precepts. That I may meditate on your wonderful days. My soul is weary with sorrow. Strengthen me according to your word. Keep me from deceitful ways. Be gracious to me and teach me your law. I have chosen the way of faithfulness. I have set my heart on your laws. I hold fast to your statutes, Lord. Do not let me be put to shame. I run in the path of your commands. For you have broadened my understanding. Teach me, Lord, the way of your decrees. That I may follow it to the end. Give me understanding so that I may keep your law. And obey it with all my heart. Direct me in the path of your commands. For there I find the light. Turn my heart towards your statues. And not towards selfish gain. Turn my eyes away from worthless things. Preserve my life according to your word. Fulfill your promise to your servant so that you may be feared. Take away the disgrace I dread. For your laws are good. How long, how I long for your precepts. In your righteousness, preserve my life. May your unfailing love come to me, Lord. Your salvation according to your promise. Then I can answer anyone who taunts me. For I trust in your word. Never take your word of truth from my mouth. For I have put my hope in your laws. I will always obey your law forever and ever. I will walk about in freedom, for I have sought out your precepts. I will speak of your statutes before kings and will not be put to shame. For I delight in your commands, because I love them. I reach out for your commands, which I love, that I may meditate on your decrees. Remember your word to your servant, for you have given me hope. My comfort in my suffering is this. Your promise preserves my life. The arrogant mock me unmercifully. I do not turn from your law. I remember, Lord, your ancient laws. And I find comfort in them. Indignation grips me because of the wicked who have forsaken your law. Your decrees are the theme of my song. 
wherever I lodge. In the night, Lord, I remember your name, that I may keep your law. This has been my practice. I obey your precepts. You are my portion, Lord. I have promised to obey your word. I have sought your face with all my heart. Be gracious to me according to your promise. I have considered my ways and have turned my steps to your statues. I will hasten and not delay to obey your commands. Though the wicked bind me with ropes, I will not forget your law. At midnight, I rise to give you thanks for your righteous laws. I am a friend to all who fear you, to all who follow your precepts. The earth is filled with your love, Lord. Teach me your decrees. Do good to your servant. According to your word, Lord. Teach me knowledge and good judgment. For I trust your command. Before I was afflicted, I went astray. But now I obey your word. You are good and what you do is good. Teach me your decrees. Though the arrogant have smeared me with lies, I keep your precepts with all my heart. Their hearts are callous and unfeeling. But I delight in your law. It was good for me to be afflicted so that I may learn your decrees. The law from your mouth is more precious to me than thousands of pieces of silver and gold. Your hands made me and formed me. Give me understanding to learn your commands. May those who fear you rejoice when they see me. For I have put my hope in your word. I know, Lord, that your laws are righteous. And that in faithfulness you have afflicted me. May your unfailing love be my comfort. According to your promise to your servant. Let your compassion come to me that I may live. For your law is my delight. May the arrogant be put to shame for wronging me without cause. For I will meditate on your precepts. May those who fear you turn to me. Those who understand your statutes. May I wholeheartedly follow your decrees. That I may not be put to shame. My soul faints with longings for your salvation. I have put my hope in your word. My eyes fail looking for your promise. I say, when will you comfort me? 83. Though I am like a wineskin in the smoke, I do not forget your decrees. Though I am like a wineskin in the smoke, I do not forget your decrees. Though 
I am like a wine skin in the smoke. I do not forget your decrees. Though I am like a wine skin in the smoke. I do not forget your decrees. Yes, no matter what it is, you shouldn't forget the decrees of the Lord. Thank you so much, Abraham Laboriel, for inspiring me to hold this instrument, for inspiring me to learn the bass guitar. Thank you so much, Integrity Music. Thank you so much, Don Moen. Thank you so much, Ron Kenoli. Thank you so much, Avin Slaughter, and all the team. You inspired many of us many years ago. And by God's grace, we are still playing the bass. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.